all these news media stations are saying the exact same thing. How is that not a systematic plan? It's a systemic dissemination of information, but it's not just, here's the notes, here's the talking point, say that. No, they are given word for word scripts that are put into teleprompters and spat out. This shit is not accidental. If a news anchor says it on television or the radio as a news report, I'd say at the very least 80% of the time, it is a script that they are reading. I agree, and Sire Character says six mega corporations own most of the media in the U.S. Right. So this cannot be a coincidence whatsoever. Well, Malcolm X said that the media is the most powerful weapon in the world because you can make bad people look good, good people look bad, and not just people, whole nations. Or entire historical perspectives. Yes. See, the goal of communism, gentlemen, is to change history as we know it. Literally change it in front of your very eyes. Look at past communist leadership that are willing to wipe out knowledge from history, burn all the books. They are willing to wipe you from existence if they feel that you are a threat to their power per se, right? Stalin did it all the time. Look at his uh, photos. The original photo had around four or five people in it, and then it will end up with just like two. Changing history itself will make themselves look even more powerful. Here's an example of them attempting to do that right now with this new movie, like The Woman King. They're trying to rewrite African history to say that Africa was anti-slavery and that it was the white man who brought the concept over. And Woman King makes no fucking sense. <laughs> yeah, that too. <laughs> right? They're changing historical events. Especially when this crew that they put in the Woman King, they're the ones that were attacking other tribes and selling them as slaves. Like, that's based on true events. The group that they try to make all heroic and look at back in the day, look, women power, yeah. No, they're the group that enabled the slave trade. They were, they were a part of that hardcore. And they try to make them look all fucking heroic and shit and Hollyweird. 